In this video, we're going to take a look at quizzes through the eyes of the students when it is assigned through Google Classroom. So here I am in a dummy Google Classroom account on my demo student account, and I'm going to go to classwork. And here is use your meet manners. This is the longer quizzes that I posted on here so that we could see the entire um, game and all of the cool things you can do on it as a student. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on web link and I'm going to choose my student account and allow permissions. Now, I always tell my students to turn all of these green. I think it's very important to have a read aloud. Um, it even helps them get ready for things like the park testing where some of it is read aloud to them. So I'm going to hit start game and remember in this mode, students compete separately. Now, before I begin, if this is a bilingual student, one of the cool things is that they can change the language, even though I posted this in English. So if they click on pause before they start, they can choose one of seven languages. For example, you know that I did mine in English. Well, I'm going to choose Spanish and I'm going to put resume game. Now, when I hit start, you're going to hear the quizzes translated into Spanish for me. Question when you are not talking, your microphone should be option uno on. Option dos, off. Oh no, I got that one wrong. It turned it red to show it's wrong. Question, one thing you would like to talk about or do in our meetings. So, um, class news. This is one of those open-ended. Now I'm going to hit that pause button again and I'm going to change it back to English, but remember there's seven different languages. Question, how I feel about using quizzes. Option one, I like it a little. This is a poll question. I would play it again. Here's a power up. These are like little add-ons and rewards that the student have. This one gives them a second chance after they get something wrong and Question. to enact what it, they just do? have to click on it. Option one, logs me out. Option two, says goodbye. Raising my hand. Now you can see I didn't let it finish that time. It still Question. moved me forward. Google Meet is a way for us to meet and learn together. Showing Question, me my running which score. Which key on your keyboard turns your microphone on? With our extension, our push to talk extension, that's true. Question What does this button do? Option what does one, that do? I'm going to get this microphone. one wrong. I'm going to say it logs me out. Yet again, it showed me the correct answer. I better pay attention Question, to that. When it is time to leave, I should. Option hmm. one Just wave goodbye. Now, it's going to give me a chance to redeem myself by attempting a question that I got wrong. Now, really, I should have used that power up, but I wanted to show you that I did have two questions incorrect. It's not going to tell me which one I'm going to get. I'm question, going to click that. When you are not talking, your microphone should be option one off option two. There it is. And of course, at the end, it's going to tell me my score. It will allow me to play this again because as the teacher, I put it on unlimited plays. And down here, it'll give me study flashcards that I can use. And it allows me to click on all of these and it will show me the question and the answer. And it even tells me which answer I picked. So. This is a great tool for the students to get instant feedback. And I just want to show you that if I close this and I go back to Google Classroom as the student now, this assignment automatically shows up as graded. This is the user meet manners that we just did. And when I view the assignment, 
the work is there with the grade of 88, it was automatically done by quizzes. On the teacher side, we'll take a look at that in another video. Um, I will show you all the reports that the teachers can see, but know that on the teacher end of Google Classroom, all the grades are going to be there for you once your students take the quiz on quizzes.